Terry Gar has passed away. Born in Lakewood, Ohio, on December 11, 1944, the celebrity was an actor, singer, and dancer. Gar grew up familiar with the industry, as her father was Broadway and film actor Eddie Gar, and her mother, Phyllis Gar, was a dancer. As she developed her career, she was best known for roles in films such as Young Frankenstein. Outside of the silver screen, Gar was also a singer and dancer who made regular appearances on The Sunny and Cher Show. As per Variety, Gar has died. She was 79 years old. The actor had been battling multiple sclerosis for a number of years, first announcing her diagnosis publicly in 2002. She suffered an aneurysm four years later in 2006. She lived for several years after, until passing away in Los Angeles on Tuesday, October 29. Gar's notable roles. Gar was nominated for an Oscar. Dr. Frankenstein, Gene Wilder, Inga, Terry Gar, and Igor, Marty Feldman, sitting together at a dinner table in Young Frankenstein. Following in her mother's footsteps, Gar began her entertainment career as a dancer. Early in her career, she presented these dancing talents in background roles in movies. It was not until 1968 that she landed her first speaking role in a movie. This was in the Monk's pop parody musical Head. From there, she received more roles in film and TV, getting her breakout role playing Inga in the horror comedy Young Frankenstein. That same year, she also played Amy in Francis Ford Coppola's 1974 film The Conversation. Gar continued her career in the film industry throughout the 70s and 80s. She played Ronnie Neary in the Steven Spielberg sci-fi classic Close Encounters of the Third Kind. In the next decade, she played a role in the 1982 film Tootsie, which ended up getting her an Oscar nomination for Best Supporting Actress. In the 1990s, she guest-starred in three episodes of the hit TV sitcom Friends, wherein she played Phoebe Abbott Sr. following her MS diagnosis, her career slowed down and she officially retired from acting in 2011. Though Gar has not worked in acting for many years now, she was packed with huge titles in the prime of her career. This came from Gar's close work with multiple hugely famous directors. Gar worked with Spielberg, Coppola, Mel Brooks, Sidney Pollock, and even Martin Scorsese. This made the actor highly prominent, as she worked with some of the biggest names in the industry. Following her passing, Gar will be remembered for this work and for the charisma and humor she brought to her characters.